Hi, boys and girls. This is Mrs. Miller to read to you guys about harp seals today. And I'm here with my son, Memphis. Again. Again. And we are going to read about these animals of the Arctic since it's so cold today and we're home on our e-learning day. So as I'm reading the story to you, I want you to be paying attention to the text features, in specific the nonfiction text features. Remember, text features can be a table of contents, they can be headings, bold print, they can be an index, a glossary, a photograph, it could be a label, a caption, all of those. And after we're done reading the story today, I'm going to ask you some questions from the book, and then I'm going to ask you some questions about the text features that we saw in the book today. So be paying attention to those text features that we see in the book as I'm reading with my son. And we are going to start reading the book now then. Table of Contents, Life in the Arctic, On the Move, Diving Hunters, Glossary to Learn More, and Index. Life in the Arctic. Harp seals swim in the icy waters of the Arctic and North Atlantic Oceans. They are built for the cold weather of this biome. Harp seals range. I'm noticing a text feature on this page. It looks like a map. And I see uh, also a text feature that is bold print. And it says biome. And we know that if we see a, a word in bold print in a story that you find it in the glossary. And then I see the heading on the page is called Life in the Arctic. Harp seals have many adaptations that keep them warm in cold weather. Thick blubber lies under their skin. Oily fur keeps their skin dry. Harp seals molt each spring. Then they grow new winter coats. Fresh coats keep them safe in the cold water and in the cold wind and water. Good. And I see a little label up there. Do you see that label up there, Memphis? Yes. Yeah. What does that say? I don't know. Molting. Molting. Yeah. And I see a photograph of a seal. A real one. Yep. Harp seals have powerful eyesight. Their big round eyes are perfect for seeing in the ocean. Special adaptation, large eyes, strong flippers, and oily fur. Their eyes make tears that protect from salt water. And I'm noticing salt water is bolded again. That means we find it where? Glossary. Yeah. On the move. Harp seals migrate south each winter when the Arctic Ocean gets too cold. Therefore, th or there, they have pups and feed. They return north for the summer. Oh, yep. You want to read this page? Yep. Read, read the heading. Okay. Driving. Diving. Diving hunters. Harp seals are built. Are built for diving. Extra ribs and large lungs mm. let them dive deeply. Deep. Or deep. Sometimes. They dive more than 328 feet. Two. Oh, 328 feet. Uh, or 100 meters. 100 meters to find food. It's pretty deep. Strong flippers help harp seals travel through water. Their whiskers and eyesight help them find food as they dive. Harp steals stats. Conservation status. Least concern lifespan. 20 to 30 years. So that means that they are not very likely to become extinct because they're not very threatened at all. So that's a good thing, but there must be lots of them. And I see whiskers and I see flippers as labels. These carnivores, uh-oh, eat many kinds of fish. Special back teeth trap tiny fish. Mm -hmm. Sharp front teeth cut the cut large fish into small pieces. Harp seal diet. Arctic cod, krill, and northern, northern shortfin squid. squid. That means that 
the carnivores are the seals. And they, they are the predator, and their prey are the cod, the krill, and the squid. Sometimes food is hard to find in the Arctic. Harp seals can live off energy from their blubber. These seals are perfect Arctic animals. Look at them upside down. That's a nice photograph. Oh, there's a glossary. That's another text feature. Can I read that there's a lot one? of words. Can, I read can you that? read that big word? No. Adaptations. Ooh. Biome. Blubber. Carnivores. Good. Coats. Energy. Uh -huh. Flippers. Migrate. Migrate. Mott. Molt. Molt. Pups. Saltwater. Whiskers. Good. So we use a glossary, remember, to tell us what words mean in the text. So if I didn't know what a carnivore was, you I would flip to the glossary. That's right. And can you see what a carnivore is? Um, a carnivore is an animal that only eats meat. Yep. So, boys and girls, now I want you to, now that we listen to the video, you are going to answer some questions below. I'm hoping you're staying warm on this cold e-learning day. Thanks. Bye.